Here we go, guys. Da -da 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 -da. They just arrived. Mail showed up. The Cobra Fang. Cobra the Enemy. It's G.I. Joe against Cobra the Enemy. Da -da 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 -da. Old Hasbro logo there. Pretty cool. There's a pilot. Cobra Fang. Now, this is a newly designed Fang. This is not exactly the same as the old Fang. It's pretty neat. Enemy pilot included, ages four and up. Hasbro. Do, 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 do. Let's see. There's the barcode for those of you who like the barcode. Nice picture on the bottom with him and his pistols. Do, 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 do. Pretty cool. Look at the back of the box. Looks great. An awesome picture of the fang there with four missiles and a bomb on the bottom. Put the turret on the front. You got a cool pilot there. It shows the turret, the engine compartment, and the rotating rotor thing in the back. Tail rotor. Cobra pilot. Roll gyrocopter pilot, primary specialty aerial combat, secondary specialty hand to hand, birthplace, various countries, because these guys come from all over. They are troopers. Cobra air troopers are basic infantry grunts with wings like ravenous mosquitoes on a summer night. They swoop down on their targets. Five different languages for that bio card there, but not as much info as an older card would have and yeah we're gonna open this because this is cool so when you open the box you got this it's wrapped up inside there pretty nice the bomb the missiles the copter part you've got a instruction sheet with these placement of stickers and a sticker sheet and your figure is trapped inside there like that. So I'll get all this out and we'll put it together. Okay, so here's what we got. We got all the stickers on now. Cobra symbols and stuff. Cool. Control panel stickers. It says Fang on the side. And first thing we got to do is stick the rotor in. Clicks in. The rotor has some stickers on it, which is cool. Spins pretty good. Awesome. And then we have the big bomb with the Cobra symbols on it, which goes on the bottom here on those two pegs. Fits ever so snugly and perfectly on there. And then we have some Fang missiles, 76X36 missiles. And they have holes in them. And those holes are going to go on these pegs. So they go. Ugh. go like so. Sorry, that was out of camera, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. I need a third hand here. There they go. They fit snugger than the old Fang. A lot snugger. Snugger, is that a word? Snugger? They're more snug than the other one. Snugglier. <laughs> P 
pinch the this and this down that'll that'll help you get those on there nice and snug my stickers off hold on so there we go we got the fang going we got this it's interesting it doesn't seem to go when you put it this way There's some directions where it doesn't want to go up. It wants to, like, I guess do that and not go up and down. Like, it doesn't seem to want to go... When it's going up and down, it doesn't want to go side to side. It wants to rotate side to side. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, and then you got the missiles that can take off. You got the seat with the... His legs go in there. So there's a lot of differences between this and the original Fang. Pretty cool. So here's our Cobra Air Trooper. You can see his ears there and this kind of face mask that he has on. Looks like he's got equipment, another gun or something attached to his chest, breathing apparatus, some kind of flak vest. He's got a gun in the holster there. That gun can come out to be used as a pistol for him. He's got some equipment, a sort of computerized thing on his neat leg there. Double jointed knees, single joint elbows. The regular twists and turns and everything for the legs, feet and arms and hands. His helmet fits on pretty snugly. He's got the uh, V symbol there on his red helmet. It can pop off, like if you do that, whoop, it's gone. So, it, you know, it's it does pop off pretty easy if you bump it. <laughs> Give you a 360 here on the pilot, just so you got it. I think he's a pretty cool pilot. I can see army building these guys. Although you gotta army build the fang to get these guys. <laughs> but you know, you could want two or three fangs in your collection if you're, you know, really building a Cobra army to have that air support in your system. I could see having two or three fangs flying around above your display. Throw the fang up on the rotator. Give you a good look at this thing from all sides as it flies around. Pretty cool looking vehicle. I like this vehicle anyways. I think it's pretty neat. It's a throwback, but yet a new design, you know? That's kind of a, a modern take on an old design, which is kind of a cool idea, I think. I'll show you a picture of the original one here to compare it with. I've got a picture here of the box to show you the original and you can see that the front end and the engine design and things are different. Unfortunately I don't have one anymore. So there we go we got the guy in there. Pilot is in the seat hanging onto the yoke. Pretty cool. Fits in pretty well. His other hand could use the gun or be just, you know, ready to hit buttons or do something. Looks pretty good in that overall. Nice. Cool. I'm digging this thing. I like it. Well, there we go, guys, the Cobra Fang, the new one from Hasbro, your retro G.I. Joe collection. Thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate it.
thankful to all you guys who are members on YouTube and to everyone who's supporting on Patreon. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. I'm John, and I'm out of here. Cobra!